hey guys please do watch the video till the end and you can see the rating i have given for both the devices as per my usage experience hey guys this is oneplus 12 a device from oneplus which is around 60000 and this is iphone 15 pro max a device from apple which costs you more than 2 and a half time of oneplus 12's cost in india is this a fair comparison i will say no but if that is the case then why am i doing this test you might be wondering about this right okay let us just check what exactly are we getting for 60000 and are we getting two and a half time better results in each and every aspect on iphone let us check in this test If you are already an Apple user or if you are already invested in Apple ecosystem no matter what you will definitely go with an iPhone again however if you are an Android user or an Apple user planning to switch to an Android ecosystem you can definitely check what exactly you can expect from a good Android device for this comparison the display is set to QHD plus and high performance mode is enabled on the OnePlus 12 Here are some of the key specification of OnePlus 12. Yeah. And here are some of the key specification of iPhone 15 Pro Max. The batteries on both the device are at 100% now and all the background apps have been closed. Let's start and to do benchmark first. During all of these benchmarks we can even see the percentage of battery that have been dropped on both the devices. The iPhone 15 Pro Max is powered by Apple's A17 Pro chipset based on 3 nanometer process and has a 6 core Apple GPU whereas the OnePlus 12 is powered by Qualcomm's Snapdragon 8 Gen 3 processor based on 4 nanometer process and is powered by Adreno 750 GPU both processors are powerful and capable enough to handle any work that you can throw at them Apple completed the Antutu benchmark test way faster than OnePlus 12 And here are the final results for your reference. OnePlus 12 had got much better scores compared to iPhone 15 Pro Max. After the test, both devices were equally warm to the touch and had lost only 1% battery during this test. As usual, let us keep the device aside for 15 minutes before starting our next benchmark test. After 15 minutes the battery level on both the devices are still at 99%. Let us start 3D Mark Wild Life Extreme Stress Test. As soon as we started the 3D Mark test, iPhone 15 Pro Max dimmed its brightness and did not recover till the test is completed. While we are at the topic of screen brightness, Apple iPhone 15 Pro Max promises a peak brightness of 2000 nits and OnePlus 12 promises a peak brightness of 1600 nit at the high brightness mode and even can reach 4500 nits while watching the HDR videos. OnePlus 12 completed this test slightly faster than iPhone 15 Pro Max and here are the score of OnePlus 12 for your reference. and here is the iPhone 15 Pro Max score for your reference in this test we can definitely see that iPhone 15 Pro Max has throttled and scored less than OnePlus 12 during this test iPhone had lost 8% of the battery and OnePlus 9% of its battery and now let us keep the devices aside for 15 more minutes before starting our next test After 15 minutes iPhone is still at 91% and OnePlus is still at 90%. Let's start the Geekbench 6 benchmark test. First we'll run the CPU test.
iPhone 15 Pro Max completed this test much earlier and had better scores compared to OnePlus 12 in the Geekbench benchmark tests. Now let us run the GPU test. Here also the iPhone 15 Pro Max completed the test earlier and as you can see the scores are almost double compared to OnePlus 12. Let us do a Wi-Fi speed test here. Even though the upload speeds are almost similar, iPhone 15 Pro Max had got better download speeds. After all four tests, you can see the battery percentage of both the devices are almost the similar. So let us do a speaker test of iPhone 15 Pro Max and the OnePlus 12. First, we'll play the music in iPhone 15 Pro Max. Let's play the same track on OnePlus 12. Honestly guys, both speaker sounds almost similar. There might be a slight bit of bass on the iPhone 15 Pro Max, but OnePlus 12 speaker is excellent and tuned perfectly. On the iPhone 15 Pro Max, we get five different shooting profiles. You can select and set whichever profile you like the best and the same will stay as the default setting whenever you open the camera app. And here is a 4K 30fps video stabilization test. And this is the microphone test from OnePlus 12. This is the microphone test from iPhone 15 Pro Max. Here are the sample shots taken from the ultra wide camera, the main camera, the 2x digital zoom on both the device. 3x optical zoom on OnePlus, 6x in-sensor zoom of OnePlus 12 and 15 Pro Max 5x optical zoom. Whenever there are reds and greens on the subject, OnePlus 12's image looked a bit washed out. In this next set of image, you can see iPhone 15 Pro Max have represented better reds and greens and have much more detail compared to OnePlus 12 thanks to the default 24MP image captured from the main sensor. This image you can see magenta hue on OnePlus 12 and iPhone 15 Pro Max having lens flare when taking an image directly towards a light source. Overall in the camera department, iPhone 15 Pro Max takes consistent images and have better color representation compared to OnePlus 12. Even though OnePlus 12 have an 8K 24fps video option, iPhone 15 Pro Max's 4K 60fps that can be taken from all the cameras are much practical compared to 8K 24fps of OnePlus 12. And here is a 3x portrait from OnePlus 12 and 5x portrait taken from iPhone 15 Pro Max. Here is a macro shot taken from both the devices. iPhone 15 Pro Max uses its ultra wide camera to take the macro shot whereas OnePlus 12 utilizes its tele macro camera and can take macros at 3x as well as 6x. In the iPhone, we can switch between all three lenses and we even have 
a 2x digital zoom option for 4k 60 fps but in the one plus 12 we have a slider where we can only go up to 6x and by the look of it it definitely looks a digital crop from its main sensor even though iphone 15 pro max have a brighter display compared to one plus 12 in many of the scenario while shooting videos or taking photos for a longer duration outside you can definitely see iphone dims its display and one plus displays is much brighter compared to iphones so there you have it guys a short one plus 12 versus iphone 15 pro max comparison video i had scored these devices as per my user experience apart from all the comparison that i have did iphone 15 pro max comes with a 3d face id and an action button one plus 12 on the other hand comes with an alert slider it comes with an optical fingerprint sensor and unlike apple one plus 12 comes with a fast charger a case and a pre applied screen protector along with the box itself one plus 12 also have a new technology called aqua touch where you can use the phone even when your fingers are wet i hope this video might have cleared few of your doubts please do comment and let me know what exactly you think about these two devices thank you for all of you who are staying till the end and please do like share comment and subscribe to my youtube channel it will give me a great motivation and help me to provide with the best content that i can do from my end till the next time take care guys have a nice day and see you all in my next video